It's Friday morning, Glads. I'm Dylan Mack. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this is your KWHS News. Before we do anything else, let's check with Miss Betsy to see what's on the lunch menu today. Happy Friday, everybody! It's been a long week. Hey, listen, we're having Mandarin chicken today, so come on down and see us. I know you love that. Um, and then on Monday, it's hot wings. I know you like them too, so come on down. Have a great one. Bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. The students, clear out your lunch charges by adding money to your account and bring in your purple free reduced lunch forms to Miss Betsy so she can process them. Glads, your book prices will go up in December, so get yours now while they're still only $55. Juniors and seniors. We have several colleges visiting us as those college application deadlines get closer. Here's the lineup. Seniors, CSU Pueblo is hosting an application day at Whitefield High School next Tuesday at lunch. If you bring your application and goal transcripts, they will help you process your application and waive the $25 fee. It's a win-win. You do have to sign up today in the counseling center for your pass. If you want to wear braid in your hair next week, check out the braid bar and chat with the rep from Tony and Guy Hairdressing Academy on Wednesday. November 8th. Seniors, on November 9th, the Herf Jones reps will be here to take your cap and gown and class ring orders. The deadline for all orders is December 21st. Remember, Adam State will close out November visit on Thursday, November 16th. As always, swing by the Counseling Center pick up your hall pass for college visits. When we come back, we'll have some fundraiser news for you. But first, here's Jared Grace with our Gladiator Sports Update. It's Friday morning, lads, and I'm Jared Grace with your Guy Air Sports Update. In forensics news, the team is headed up to Woodland Park tomorrow, November 4th, for their next tournament. Best of luck to these competitors. Our Guy Air football team is at CA Foster tonight and could still clinch the league championship when they take on Pueblo West at home at 7 p.m. Come out and support the lads. Tonight's game is dubbed the color game. If you need a white t-shirt to participate, student cabinet is selling them in the quad for $5. Our Lady Glass volleyball team heads into the first round of regional play this Saturday at Palmer Ridge. Ladies first play Palmer Ridge at 9.30 and then take on Erie at 11 a.m. Speaking of volleyball, guys interested in Gents Volleyball Tourney? Sign-ups are going on until November 8th before and after school in room 103. The cost to enter a team is $5 for 17 members. The tournament runs from November 13th to the 17th. Gentlemen, if you missed the basketball meeting with Coach Munoz on Wednesday and you plan to try out for the team this year, you should check with him in room 207 for the information you missed. Attention all winter sports athletes. Yellow cards and physical forms are still available in the main office. If you already have a physical on file, just pick up your yellow card. Winter sports practices start on November 10th. This announcement is for all athletes. It's never too early to start preparing to play sports in college. To help you with that, Mr. Hall and Mr. Theo are presenting guidelines for NCAA eligibility on Tuesday, November 7th at 6 p.m. in the WHS library. They will cover numerous topics having to do with NCAA eligibility. If you want to play sports at a Division I or Division II school, you should come check out this important presentation. Now here's Doc with our health tip of the week. Hey guys, it's Doc with your health tip of the week. So this week we're talking about eating healthy. Yes, fruits and vegetables. Did you know you need at least four servings of fruit and five servings of vegetables every single day? So if you eat a fruit and vegetable at every meal, you're likely to get these servings. Fruit and vegetables have lots of vitamins and minerals that help us stay healthy and strong and they'll help our immune system in the coming days whenever it's getting cold outside. So make sure you're eating your fruits and vegetables and staying healthy. Thanks, Doc. Glad to check back next Friday when Doc chats about hydration. And remember, Doc will be holding a meeting on Monday, November 6th at 3 p.m. for those of you interested in becoming a student athletic trainer for winter sports. The meeting will be in room 511. Good luck to all our sports teams this coming weekend. That's it for a sports update. Have a great day. I'm Jared Grace. Now back to you, Dylan and Ethan. Thanks, Jared. Hey, Glad. The first fundraiser going on right now is the F. CCLA customizable magnetic jewelry sales. 
if you want the best Charlie Gladiator necklace ever, or maybe a keychain, bracelet, ring, or a charm, visit the website to order yours today. Our next fundraiser is happening on Monday, November 6th from 5 to 8. NJROTC is having a spirit night at the Chick-fil-A on Mesa Ridge Parkway. Come out and be a winner with a chicken dinner. If you haven't had a chance to check out the new Gladiator gear in the student store, you should stop by the attendance or business offices to see what's new. The store is open in the cafeteria before school on Mondays and Friday, and after school on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Friday. And now, here are your club and activities updates for for Friday. Student Union is open in the library every afternoon from 3 to 4.15. Be sure you have a sticker on your ID. The Guitar Club meets in room 2 after school with Mr. White. If you want to store your guitar until the end of the day, see Mr. White. Glads. It's early and even scary to be talking about final exams, but they are just around the corner. If you would like some help studying for finals, raising your grade before the semester ends, or general tutoring, NHS has your back. NHS students have free tutoring sessions every Thursday during advisor. Sign up in the library on Thursday mornings. Remember, the library will only be available on Thursdays for computer use and tutoring. The Whitefield High School Theater Department presents Anne of Green Gables on November 10th and 11th at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. Tickets are $3 for students and $5 for adults. Come support your fellow GLADs. Finally, Daylight Saving Time happens this Sunday at 2 a.m. Remember to set your clocks back an hour this weekend. Well, that's all for us today. Have a great Friday. I'm Dylan Mack. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this was your KWHS News. Have a great weekend. Remember to set your clocks back. <laughs>